Unexpected. Hi everybody, my name is Sean Alexander, and welcome back to <coughs> Fun in Paradise. Now this episode will be about 30 minutes. I'm just gonna say right here, right now. I wanted to make this because I'm a, I'm a bit bored. Um, but this episode will probably contain like a lot of stuff. So, anyways, it's the weekend, three day weekend, and. I know, this is not the first thing you'd expect to see on the weekend, but it's what I got time for. So, without further ado, let's activate this memento! Okay. Aww. Stupid. Hey. Been waiting for me, huh? What took you so long? Sheesh, I made it, didn't I? I got a life, you know. Whoa, where'd you learn to do that? It's called talent. Come on, why don't you guys show me your school? Yeah, the classroom should be cleared by now. We're gonna stay for our bond practice as well. Yeah, yeah, lead the way. <clears throat> Aw, don't they remind you of us when we were young? Not one bit. Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay. Huh, the school looks familiar. Oh shit, sir. Oh man, we're crossing so many realities right now. This is, um, this is the high school from To the Moon. Small world. Then again, I guess many of the geezers here grew up in the same area. This is where we have our, our art class. Neat! Are any, of those, uh, are any of these drawings yours? No, mine got thrown out. These are the good ones. Jeez. That sucks. Is the cafeteria locked? No, I just don't like going in there. There are plenty of other nicer and quieter places to eat at. Okay. The one class everybody slacks off at. Can you actually work? Eh, I like these classes. If you really try hard, you can create an entire world in them. How cool is that? Well, that does sound like your thing. It really does, Colin. Jeez. So boring. <laughs> when you were younger, I mean. And I sit over here. Although, I'm probably gonna move soon. How come? Well, I sat with this old girl, because we are both really quiet but recent. Well... She's been hanging out with someone a lot. So? So they want they want to sit together, of course. They're banging you up! Let me beat him up for you. Oh, it's nothing like that. They just look happy together. So I should get them a seat at the table, right? What a push over. <sighs> You remind me of me. Sad. Oh. Oh man, it's 
Oh, dang, Colin. Playing scales in an orchestral level now, huh? She taught him well. Okay, then. You always keep reverting to these new things. Um, <laughs> oh, there you go. Get on up. Woo! That was a super quick memento. Oh, man. It's gonna be difficult. Mm. Actually, that was super easy. Huh. Man, uh, I'm getting quicker at this game. Back to my momento. You know, if fate was so important that he recalls so much about her even now. What happened to her? We haven't seen any traces on later. Later on. I have a few guesses. Yeah, me too. Bagnabbit. I'm pretty sure Faye changed her name. That that's my that's my biggest guess. She got caught up in something terrible and then she changed her name. Is that's exactly what's gonna happen, isn't it? That is exactly what's about to happen. An airline pilot hat. Oh no, wait, okay, this is a hospital. Who are you? Wrong room, sorry. Sorry, Fia. The storm grounded my plane back all day. And I just... Oh, Asher. You made it. Oh, the birth of Asher. Is that... Honey, you're vibrating the baby. I'm just gonna be right back. Huh. Maybe Faye was like a figment of his imagination to get him through his young years of life. Huh. Be there, right? Of course I am. It's just that I don't know. I was such a, I was in such a rush to get back and suddenly seeing him here. I guess I just needed a moment for it to sink in. Hey, it's okay. I feel it too, you know. But well, maybe it's as they say. Maybe we we're never meant to feel righty. How could I when I feel no different from the kid I was yesterday? But you are. You are different, even from the man you were when I first met you. I don't know what changed, but you're no longer aloof, you know? And you're actually here. You're actually 
here. Hey, I couldn't even make it here when he was born. Oh, hey, we didn't know he was so eager to meet us, Ellie. What matters is you're here now, and we're gonna be okay. Paper airplane. Yeah, we're gonna be okay. So I'm really, really. Because the last episode, I don't know if I guys told you this, but last episode I had, I had a huge theory where it's like, oh, Faye got. Got mixed up in some shit, and then she got caught by the police, and then she needed to like change her name or something. Or <clears throat> was it maybe that Faye died, or maybe um Faye? I don't know. Uh, okay, the paper airplane, of course. One. Is a really short mem. These are all really short memories, and I like it. Prepare. This is exactly why I didn't want uh, want the episode to be this long, because it's not long at all. Um. Wait. wait. Oh man, this is gonna be a difficult one. Um, I'm gonna add you there. Oh, this isn't difficult. Why am I saying that's difficult? There you go. Super duper easy. Again, I'm figuring out these puzzles in like split seconds. I wanted to make this 30 minutes. We're already past like our first two memories. My gosh. I have to wait memento. How could I? When I feel no different from the kid I was yesterday. But you are different. Even from the man you were when I first met you. Okay. What is this? Ooh, we're on the other side. Uh, how far out? <clears throat> Where is he? Did we get drifted from the spawn point? Don't worry, I got this. Finally, we're gonna play as Neil. Took about an hour and a half. Then so there's actually, I, I did want to make this a 30 minute episode, but we're getting these mementos too quick. See on the other side, right? We could just shh. Look, Neil. All I need to do is get over that wall. I don't know what you're planning, but let's try and keep it simple. Don't worry, it doesn't get any simpler than this. Oh my God, what are you doing? Is that hook thought? Come on, give me a break. I've always wanted to try this. All right, I guess it's straightforward enough. Yeah. Oh what? Um. Okay. Boom. What are you doing? That was already high enough. Not for me. It isn't. Infilet Eva. What? 
This hook shot. This is the hook shot that will pierce the heavens. Um. Oops. Oops. Dude, unshrink Jupiter and put it back in orbit right now. Relax, it was just copy paste, not cut paste. Not to mention the part in the part procedurally generated. <laughs> now let me just turn on its localized gravity. Wait, what? Uh, what is wrong with you? What, you said it was alright to use my hook saw it. Now let's turn gravity off and... Yes, that's how you do it. By Jupiter, thanks for the lift. Oops. And you lost your hook shot. At least it wasn't Uranus. What was that? Nothing. Let's get going. Oh, Ava. Alright. Huh. Talk about staying up past bedtime. Don't even bother. What? It's not gonna fly over, you know. Why did I just make her British? It's not gonna go. It's not gonna fly over, you know. We're too far apart. So, are you ever gonna finish telling me that story? Hmm. The one with the injured bird you found when you were a kid. There's not much to it. You know how it goes. The bird had a broken wing and I took care of it for a while. I knew it! If it hasn't already been confirmed, this is a bird story. The vet took it in afterwards, but... But what? But I tried to steal the bird back. You thought you'd take better care of it? Of course not. I knew I shouldn't have. Then why? Because it was my only friend, I guess. I just didn't want it. I just didn't want to let it go. Well, what a load of sappy shark! Mm. I might give you a handkerchief for a dog, or even a cat, but a bird? I knew I shouldn't have said anything. Everyone I told that story to either thought I got bored or thought oh, I got bored to sleep. Yeah, can't help you there. But everyone goes into things with their own context, you know? Maybe it's only fair that they didn't catch that they didn't care much for it. Maybe the bird was something different then to you than it was to them. Or maybe you just sucked at telling that story. I just wanted them to relate. Yeah, how'd that work out for you? Not every story is meant to be told, you know? Some of them are meant to be kept. So, how did it all end? I, I think the bird, the bird flew off. I think I lost it, but it came back to say goodbye one day. You think? I don't know, I kept on mixing up reality with Jane Dream back then. I guess I was living in my head a little too much. Huh, you're getting better at this. I used to daydream about taking off in a big paper ride plane, you know. You fly all around the world, seeing all kinds of sights. And I could just fly across from balcony to balcony. Well, that's dumb. You can't fly on paper planes, silly. No, duh. I mean, if you really want to fly so bad, why don't you just go and become a pilot? Heh. Wait, you're serious? Yeah, why not? What do you mean, why not? One doesn't simply just go and become a pilot. Why doesn't one? Because 
How? Well, I had sake off from airports, right? It doesn't hurt to find one and ask. That's... If only it could be that simple. If you just let it be, maybe it could. I should go, Colin. I know. Hey. I'm gonna look for the airport tomorrow. Good for you, Colin. Okay, this memory is a bit longer than expected. Oh. <sighs> oh, the friendly girl next door would be one way to get inspired to fly, I guess. Well, it seems like you ran into a poster sale. Or puberty. <laughs> I mean, if you really want to play so bad, Faye said, why won't, why don't you go and become a pilot? So the screen book from the shelf is just a journal. Seems legit. It is. Locked. All the heck? I'm supposed to get back. The balcony room like this is turned sure confident than a sleepwalk lessness. Ooh, shiny thing. Poster of tropical island surrounded by a lagoon and barrier reef. Hmm, that looks familiar. Same place as the painting hanging above his bed in his elderly days. He's also keeping this exact same picture in the attic even now. For a teenager, he sure had some old-fashioned taste in posters. Yeah, I did. What else is, uh, is this shining over here? I don't see anything shiny. Oh, we can go back outside. I don't think there's anything else left. Remembering all these late night conversations on his dying bed. Tisk tisk. Um. Okay. I don't know what to do. What's what's the third thing? Um. Uh. Huh. Didn't think I had it in him. Hey, prepare the memento. And then I think you should be done with this episode. There you go. And then... Well... This... That... And then this... And then, oh. And boom. Boom. No, it's a boom. It's a boom. That should be 50, but sure. Make it a hundred, why don't you? <sighs> and let's activate that memento. And we'll read this little part over here and then we'll, um, we'll stop. We seem to be getting to the center of it all. Well, so much for the cliffhanger on whether he became a pilot, hey? More like cliffhanger. <laughs> Oakland Center, Cactus 135, cruising flight level 3, minor, niner, zero. Cal 
Cactus 135 Oakland Center Altimeter Setting 3007 Sia Altimeter 0 Altimeter 3007 Cactus 135 out See Green Orn, you gotta play by the rules and use them proper radio Every single time even when you're not on the radio at home, to your wife. But the chief instructor said, Do I look like the chief instructor? Is her face also endowed with this award-winning mustache? Don't think I'll be going easy on you just because this is your first flight with the company. As my first officer, there are only two things I ever want to hear from you. They're yes, captain, and landing gear down. That's funny, sir. Do I look funny to you? No, you don't, sir. What did I just say about the only two things I expect to hear from you? Yes, Captain. So, do I look funny to you? Uh, landing gear down? Son of a gun. Send me all the brainless pretty ones. This can't be serious. Well, you know how memories get exaggerated sometimes, I hope. Okay, well, let's end it off there. I think that's a pretty extended episode. But there, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed another beautiful episode of uh, Finding Paradise. If you guys do want to see more, remember to join me back on Tuesday for some more and more and more. And these next few episodes, though, they're probably just going to be <clears throat> one memory each because I want to make this series like 30 episodes long. So, anyways... I'll see you guys <clears throat> very soon. Bye-bye.